one, that is frankly overdue, we'll explain why, and B, in incredibly high demand. This is the Apple iPad. Now, number one question that people have when we do the TSV as an Apple anything is, is this the latest one? And trust me, I'm asking that question as well when I go to my guests to talk about technology. Is this the latest one? And candidly, sometimes it's not. Like we got a really great value on the second to most recent one. That's not the case here. We brought this brand new, latest generation, latest everything iPad to you initially in January. It wasn't a today's special value. It was a great value, but not the TSV. And it was so overwhelmingly popular, we went back to our buyers and said, we got to do this again, but do it on a day where more people are watching and therefore able to see the deal and more people have an opportunity to get an even better deal. And why does everybody want the iPad to begin with? It is essentially now, and as it has evolved, has become more like a portable computer than ever before. They started out as e-readers, right? And a cool way to surf the web. But now you're not just streaming videos and listening to music and FaceTiming your family. You're crafting and creating documents and PowerPoints and full-on presentations. You're gaming on it. You're doing all the things that you would expect to do in a computer, only now you're doing it with the latest technology and QVC's extras, which are all the great accessories that we polled our viewers and heard these are exactly what you want. Now, when you factor in those accessories, the software, the iPad, the Bluetooth keyboard, the carry case, well, you're over $1,000, right? And in the world of tablets, there is no better than the iPad. Yeah, 1000 bucks or 1200 if you're going with our largest memory ever offered. But here, instead of $1,200, that 256 gig is under 800. Here's the problem. It is 1226 in the afternoon. Half of our quantity on the 256 gig is gone. I will tell you that we are actually doing the rare effort on a weekend to try to find more quantity for you. I do not have an update on that. So I'm unable to share with you if we have it. You need to run on the assumption that we don't. Half of our quantity on the largest memory ever offered on the iPad, gone by noon. Now, that itemized list right there that you see doesn't include the iPad. That itemized list is for all of the accessories that you're getting included and software as well. This tote bag, this polyurethane tote, keeps it protected. This cover right here actually has within it a Bluetooth keyboard to fully make this a portable computer. And you get earbuds, and you get a stylus, and you get a stand. Okay, how do we make this even more affordable? Oh right, five easy pays on everything. For every credit card out there, but Jen, I have a Q card. Do you have a special deal for me? You know it. 12-month interest-free special financing. Little menu of how you're gonna choose is there on your screen. We start with storage. Do you want the 64 gig or the, I never have to worry about memory again, 256 gig, that's what everybody's going with. From there, fun part, color of iPad. Silver, but update, silver. Uh, okay. So it's official. We're down, at least for now, to only the 64 gig in the silver. Ask about wait list, and if we get more 256 gigs loaded into our system, you're the first to get it. Here it is in the yellow. We have the pink and the blue. Now, these are the actual colors of the iPads, not a protective case. But if you want the protective cases, which you're going to get either way, you let us know what color of the cases you want. So color of iPad, color of accessories. white black, blue, celestial is your lavender, rose gold, and the aqua is called Capri. Free shipping and handling. 12 months special financing if you shop with your Q card. Hey, all that's pretty cool and I've heard a lot of great things about the iPad. Or, hey, that's really cool. I've been looking to upgrade my iPad. Well, I have an iPad. And I can tell you just in the brief presentation that I have with our tech expert, Justin Sachoka, I learned more things that I could do with my existing <laughs> iPad from this gentleman than um, I think are even in my head that I can do. So yep. the world, the universe that is iPad or Apple technology is always expanding. But like I was joking earlier, I'm like, Justin's a tech expert. We don't need the tech expert. We really just need him right now to show us the cool things that it can do. Because if you are 0% tech savvy, it doesn't matter when it comes to Apple.
doesn't matter. That's the great thing about it is that it's something that you're going to explore and you're going to learn, oh wait, I could turn my lights on and off with my iPad. Oh wait, this can translate, this can speak to me. It can dictate all of my text messages. Wait, it can send a text message. You're gonna have all of those little moments as you're using this where you're going to realize that the iPad fits into your life in so many different ways. And I would say that the iPad in comparison to other tablets that are out there fits into your life better than any other tablet as well, just because of the amount of stuff that's in there and how many <laughs> features you get. That's technical term, Yeah, right? that is the absolute technical. <laughs> that's what they taught me in college. I love it, it works. It is the 10th generation of the iPad, so this is the most recent, latest, greatest, which means you have the biggest in size, a 10.9 inch retina display, and there's less of a bezel, so that means more screen and more uh, retina display resolution to love choice of 64 gigabytes or 256. And Jen, that's kind of major because if you're out there with a, a fourth generation, you only had a choice of 32 or 64. That's right. So can you imagine if you have a 32 gigabyte going up to 256, uh. like eight times the memory. <laughs> True Tone technology is going to adjust the screen temperature to the light situation that you're in. If you've ever been on a plane and it's really dark and the bright light is blinding you, well, actually it will dim down automatically. Wi-Fi 6 insi is inside of this. That's gonna give you the fastest connection to your internet because let's face it, we're you know used up uh, on our internet with everything in our house, our smart plugs, my garage door is on the internet, my amount of tablets, computers, you name it. There are so many devices that are on that. They're all going and grasping for that strong connection. What this does with Wi-Fi 6 is it actually is like the fast pass from the amusement park. This puts you at the front of the line so that your iPad is gonna get the strongest connection and be prioritized above everything else. Just by bringing this home for that one upgrade alone means that your Teams meeting, your Zoom meeting, it's going to be an improved experience across the board. That's why you wanna upgrade with this. If you have like an older computer, you're gonna find, wow, I'm using this iPad a lot more than my computer because it's oh, yeah. faster. Yeah. The screen quality, the, the anti-glare, the high definition of video, like everything about it, that true uh, sensory experience is better. Heck, I know a lot of people who prefer their iPads to their iPhones just because the text is bigger, right? Like you have a, a bigger screen and therefore bigger experience, so it's easier on the eyes as well. I do want to kind of bounce around a little bit because I know we're going to play and show features. We have a more abbreviated presentation this yeah. time. So for those who maybe watch at midnight or you saw us earlier in the show and you're going, you know, I think I'm going to Jen said they're halfway gone through the quantity in the, in the 256, and maybe I'm gonna go ahead and do this, but I'm confused because I don't know the difference between 64 and 256. I don't blame you, right? How do I help her decide which one is best for her? Yeah, so when we're talking about that, well, let me start off with this statement. Have you ever walked into a kitchen that you were looking at in a new home and you saw the, the cabinet space and you said to yourself, well, there's just too many kitchen cabinets in here? Never. I don't think that sentence has ever Gosh, actually I hate all been... these walk-in closets in my home. Right, right, yeah. Never. I hate having all this space to store everything. No, you hear the opposite. Oh my gosh, I wish I didn't have to go get that extra storage unit because I don't have enough room in my house. Or, oh no, I wish I didn't have to get rid of some of my appliances because they don't fit in my kitchen. You don't want to have the moment that comes up where you say, hmm, I really wish I went with the 256 gigabyte because the thing is you can't add on more memory later on. So 64 gigabyte versus 256. You can take a look at that storage chart right here and that's going to tell you exactly the breakdown of the amount of images, the amount of video, the amount of songs that you'll be able to put on there. And that's a really good gauge to be able to help you to understand which one you may want to go with. I'm a 64 gigabyte user. Now that surprises most people yeah, because you think, me. yeah, like tech guy is gonna have the most memory. Not the case. I actually stream all my content. I watch uh, Netflix and Hulu and Apple TV and Peacock. I'm just thinking in my head, like, what are all the ones that I pay for? Those are that's <laughs> a list of all the ones that end up coming up where I'm streaming content. But when I go on to a trip, I download a couple of TV shows and then I delete it as soon as I watch it. And that's perfect for me. It takes a little bit of management. It's like, I'm gonna go to the desk because yeah, I just love this It's analogy. a good little demo. You've got to. Then I'll walk you through the colors again. How's that? It's like this front, this drawer, right? I need to manage this a little bit. Take some stump, stuff out, put some stuff back into it. It's not Right, so too if I bad. hand you another book, then you gotta take a book out to put I'm gonna have to take a book out to put yeah. a new book in. I mean, it's a little tedious, but it's not terrible. But if the option exists to have a desk that has four drawers in it, where I can really fill it up with stuff, then that's fantastic. It's feature-proofing. 
totally. You're future proof. And if you are somebody that that really needs to even future proof yourself more, we do have this available at that little eye expander. Another 256 gigabytes that lives on this plugs right into your iPad to be able to help the, expand that memory even further. So that's right. Great um, for now, because we have it available. 256 is the way to go. Yep. And um, I mean, I feel like I say this every week at this point, and I should probably get used to it. But I come into Saturday morning queue and we're counting down at today's special value. It's first thing in the morning for most people. <laughs> but so many of you have been waiting for this. So you're actually getting way ahead of next year's back to school. You're going, yep. computer took a beating over the last three years, and it's just, it's given up the ghost, and I don't want a computer. I want, like, basically the equivalent of the computer in the palm of my hand. And don't forget, guys, can you show everybody the, um, the oh, Bluetooth keyboard? Yeah, absolutely. You're getting that Love included, that. and it operates via Bluetooth. There's no wire. It just connects to your iPad, and now, any, like you're in an email situation, you just start typing, and it takes that, and it's also the protective case. So, with that said, with me not having any idea when the next TSV from Apple iPad is, and with us being able to now officially tell you that what I'm, the countdowns that I'm giving you are the countdowns that I'm giving you, here are the countdowns, right? So you're going to choose between 64 gigabyte and 256 gig. From there, you're going to choose the color of the iPad that you want. There are new ones, right? I'm used to just seeing the, the space gray and the silver. Now we have silver, yellow, pink, and blue. From there, and they're all the 10 inch screens. So you're not choosing different screen sizes, it's just the memory size. From there, you let us know what color of accessory bundle do you want. Is it the white, the black, the celestial, the blue, rose gold, or the capri. Now, I want to talk about the yellow iPad for what we have remaining purposes. 256 gig in the yellow. We only have in the rose gold accessories, and only 100 of those remain. Okay. If you want the blue iPad in 256 gig, White, 175 remain. Mm -mm. If you want the blue, black, 256 gig, that's the most popular option right now across the board. There are five dozen left. Blue and blue sold out. Blue, celestial sold out. Blue, capri, two dozen. Wow. Just a few more than that in the rose gold. And that's all in the 256. Hey, Mike, um, another question for you. How many orders have been placed in this show? Okay, so we've had 1,700 orders in this show. So when I say 170, six dozen, four dozen, even knowing that it's a $700, $800 purchase, those dozens can go in a snap. And every time we let everyone know how few there are, I'm sure a lot of people go and make their purchase. So waiting. Not wise. I don't like to, to hit the gas pedal on things too hard because I don't want to seem like I'm a high pressure kind of person. But the thing is, if you know you want that memory, because I've been through this so many times and I come in ready for my show at 8 p.m. and Justin's <laughs> like, we only have the 64 gig. And you know what I do when that happens? I go, awesome. You'll get great use out of that 64 gig. Totally. But if you can get that 256, man, I'm, I'm all about it for sure. Okay, so we're spending a lot of time obviously talking to you about quantities and, and the value and they're all really important. But I want to give Justin the floor so he can tell us a little bit more about what we can do. Yeah, well, I love that in this bundle, what we give you is that little <laughs> software voucher, which by the way, hold on to the back of it. You'll find it in the box. That's going to have the all of the little things you could yeah. the codes to use it. This is one of them that you're going to be able to, to use. This is curious.com. You can download the app and every day you're going to find all of these fun little, uh, it's called mm -hmm. the curio cabinet, little things that are tidbits of information. Like if you're mm -hmm. ever one of those people who's like, huh, that guy, that guy knows everything about everything. <laughs> this may be the way for you to be able to do that. We give this to you for a year. Crossword puzzles that you can do on here. So we're giving you all of that stuff. Really great for that brain training. Oh, yeah. Another program that we give you is Buxfer. What I love about this program is it actually will allow for you to be able to connect to your financial institution, and then it's going to help you to budget everything out. Oh. It will automatically take all of those different um, all of the different transactions that are happening, and it's going to implement them in here to help you budget. So when you look at this Can you tablet, click on this so I can see all your account numbers? Yeah, absolutely, okay, yeah, let's, let's go for it. Uh, wait, they won't be very big, so <laughs> it won't be that exciting. When it, when it comes to the, uh, the iPad, I think this is just a perfect example of how this is going to be able to help you to save money. Like, I get that this is an investment for now and, and an investment up front, but what about being able to go into pages and being able to use this in such a way so that you are going to be able 
able to uh, maybe come up with that vacation budget. Maybe this is the way in which you're going to track that new home improvement project that you've got going on. I just finished the basement in my house and that was a nine month process, it took forever, but I really learned about how important oh, the home budget ownership. is, yes. seriously. <laughs> <laughs> wow. No, why didn't anyone tell you? It's like, oh, yeah, it, it they don't tell you about all every that. Every penny you, you make goes right uh -huh. into the house. But, you know, it come, come, came a long way. It's, it it yeah, keeps it's on right. going. But even from like the DIY kind of projects, I my patio, I'm building a wall. So that's like tomorrow. I always, the day after I present a TSV, it's like my day to be at home. <laughs> so tomorrow is the day that I build the wall in the back of the patio. And I'm going to do